You're watching CBS 2 News in high definition. We're switching gears here for just a moment. Great weather today makes us look forward to sunny days and even having to apply sunscreen. But how do you choose the best one? CBS 2's Dr. Holly Phillips joins us to sort things all out. The sun is out in all its glory and so are its skin damaging rays. Research shows 90% of wrinkles are caused by the sun's UVA light. Manhattan dermatologist Dr. Craig Austin says SPF is your best defense. I think it's essential that we use SPF all year round because the changes from the sun are cumulative over a lifetime. So the more sun you're exposed to, the more you're going to age prematurely. And we don't have to wait for beach weather. We're in the middle of April now. That's actually two months from the summer solstice. It's almost the equivalent of being out in the sun in the middle of August. I don't know the amount that is required now. Is it going up 45 or something like that? When you buy a sunscreen, look for one with a minimum SPF of 30 and with UVA and UVB protection. UVA rays break down collagen, which causes wrinkles. UVB is the main culprit behind sunburn. I'm a letter carrier, so I'm always walking outside. I'm always working outside in the sun, so I know uh, got to protect the skin. Understanding SPF can be confusing, but it's much easier when you look at percentages. SPF 15 blocks 93% of incoming UVB rays. SPF 30 blocks 97%, and SPF 50 blocks 99%. Dr. Austin says there are some common application pitfalls. People don't apply sunscreen liberally enough, and they don't apply it often. And those are two very important things. Reapply your sunscreen every two hours, no matter what SPF you choose. And don't forget the ears and the back of the hands. Just because it's a cloudy day, don't forget to apply your sunscreen. Up to 40% of the sun's ultraviolet radiation actually reaches the Earth through complete cloud cover. And that can cause sun damage even when you're not expecting it. Chris, I have to say, back from your recent vacation, yeah. you don't look like you were applying your sunscreen I, you know, liberally. I actually, I actually did probably not enough, but I actually <laughs> did because, as we know, it, all it takes is one bad burn, no matter what age, that can come back to haunt you at you're, a later age. Huh? You're absolutely right. All right, Doctor, thank you very much.